This week in Stockholm we have hosted the Stockholm Scenario Festival and it's about short, tight games. And the idea has been to make it, uh, make it very close so people can come here and play. So we are in Stockholm and we had, dur during this whole weekend we had a lot of games and we had people coming from at least six different countries, all of the Nordic countries and some more. I've just yeah. been the whole weekend at the Scenario Festival and I've played six different scenarios. Um, which have been very, very different, ranging from uh, non-verbal, art, drama, poetry, music, LARP in the 1890 Montmartre, to uh, a sex, drugs and rock and roll LARP, uh, about a rock band just losing their grip. So I actually tried game mastering for the very first time, which was really great. I had a small group, four people only, and I had a scenario called In Your Hands, which was physical and really great, lots of emotions, and I, I really enjoyed it. I thought this was a really great cozy sort of festival. Um, I like the small size, and I also like that they had uh, older scenarios that you could replay. Um, I thought that was really cool. I love the idea of having just a classic track uh, at a convention, even one where lots of new stuff is being produced. I also really enjoyed the mix of um, black box and freeform, because uh, I haven't gotten to play very many black box games. Uh, so while I've been here, uh, mostly what I've done is uh, run games. I uh, ran a bunch of uh, classic cheap form uh, and I ran my own game. And then I played in uh, the amazing Black Fox LARP, The White Death. Come to play on lots of sad stuff, but I also have had some lots of funny moments and many tender moments. And I'm really impressed by everybody I met and everybody involved in uh, creating this festival as players and organizers and game writers. Well, it, it's been very different uh, settings and I just uh, came from one which I'm... Uh, I feel a lot <laughs> right now. Uh, it was called The One That Got Away um, and I played uh, an aging father uh, sitting in a rowing boat with his uh, grown-up son fishing and uh, it was a very loving atmosphere, uh, but we had things we needed to talk about, but no one knew how to start. Um, and in the end, um, this old uh, father died, and he had two breaths uh, to say his last words. It was um, a beautiful ending to this weekend. I've just played a game that's called The Previous Occupants, which is a horror LARP. Um, and it was fantastic. Um, I was almost a little skeptical. I just didn't know how a horror LARP would really work. Um, but it, it's been really fun and we really got um, a great feeling for it. And it's been like that actually at the, at the whole uh, scenario weekend. I have been surprised and I have uh, enjoyed myself immensely. I have met lots of very fun and interesting people. And um, yes, I am definitely coming back. <laughs>